Today we're gonna demonstrate how to calibrate a sugar dispenser. So first, let's look at the button. So we have a small, medium, and large, and an extra large button. Let's turn the machine and look in the back because that's where we will enter the program into the machine so if you look on the circuit board you will see three buttons one of the buttons says hop one down and the other one says program in order for us to calibrate the machine we have to select the program button and you will see the lights illuminate once the light illuminate that's when we will start the programming but before we do that we have to um, test all the appropriate size on the machine just to make sure we're not calibrating one that already is at the correct amount so we need a calibrating tube with our calibrating tube we will use it to measure each sizes that way we know the exact amount okay so let's go back to the back of the machine and now we will just select the button and you will see the lights illuminate on the board okay there you have it the lights are now on okay you can see all of those lights but let's go back and take a look at the machine normally we find that sometimes the machine does not dispense the right amount of sugar and that can be a reason that caused from the plunger and this that you're looking at right now that's a solenoid and here is the clamp screw that hold the hose in place that dispense the sugar okay so normally we have to clean that up sometime we have to change the hose this is the plunger that i'm holding here right now um that when you press the shoot the, the button the sugar will dispense once the plunger um release okay so let's clean this up and put everything back together and then I'll come back and show you guys what it looks like. Okay. All right. So now I have everything together. So everything is now in place. So I'll just fit it to the machine. And once it's fit onto the machine, then I can start the calibration process. There you go. It's now on the machine and now we can begin programming the machine so i'll start normally with the size that is off and once i select the size and i see how much is dispensed like there in the tube right now so i'll look at that and i'll see how much i need to adjust and once I know what amount I need to adjust, then I will go to the back of the machine and I would select the program button and then I'll dispense once more. And after I dispense the sugar, then I will decide whether I need to go up or I need to go down. And the button at the back that says hop when you go hop three times by punching the button it will adjust the sugar at least one 
milliliter each time you click on it three time okay uh, and if the same if you do that three times down it will adjust the sugar at least one milliliter okay so let's go to the back and demonstrate so click on that button again and let this the, the um, board light up so once it's light up like this let's click on that see there you go so it's light up there now and we'll dispense the sugar there we go select the pro appropriate size so I'm doing an extra large so I click on the extra large button and then I'll see how much I need to adjust so there you go at the back I'll adjust it so I need to go up so I'll press the button one two three four five six seven eight eight times and after that then I'll release the button that says program to remove the light so it's no longer in the program mode and I'll go back and test the extra large sugar once more so when I look at my calibrating tube and I'll see the amount that it says so look at that so I'm looking for a total of 18 milliliter so if it's at 18 milliliter that simply means it's okay so that looks pretty good mm -hmm. you see that's pretty much there so I don't need to adjust it anymore so that's 18 18.5 19 19.5 20 so I'm at 18 so that's good so I don't need to adjust that one anymore so once you have the appropriate amount in your calibrating tube then you know that the program was done correctly okay so that's good and then we can move on to the next one that needs to be programmed so just a quick preview and how everything looks after it cleaned up and ready to go back into the machine okay thanks for watching